everything must go. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Hey, it's no secret here that I have entirely too much stuff. That being said, it is time for me to purge and declutter all of these unnecessary products. But before we get into today's video, please make sure that you are subscribed and be sure to hit that notification bell boo so you don't miss when I upload another video. And if you enjoyed the video, I'd greatly appreciate if you gave me a thumbs up. But if you give me a thumbs down, nobody really cares because they can't see it anymore. And if you are interested in any single product that I mentioned here today, be sure to shop at the links down below in the description box because they really help to support my channel thank you so much i appreciate you not even gonna lie i can't even believe that i am ready to part ways with some of these products a number of these products are staples that i have raved to you all about in countless videos but y'all i have too much stuff so the products that i'm mentioning in today's video in conjunction with others that i don't mention will be listed on my depop you can find the link down below in the description box and fyi every single product that i am selling to you all is brand spanking new now that we've gotten that very long intro out of the way let me show you all the products that i'm getting rid of so first i'm going to be getting rid of this curls the sea moss collection powerhouse sea moss cleanser and honestly, I just haven't been blown away by the reviews that I have seen of this collection. Plus, you all already know that I have fallen in love with the Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Wash from Curls. And so, if I got that, why would I need this? Exactly. I have absolutely no desire to try this Seamoss Collection Cleanser. So... I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it. I'm, I'm going to get rid of it. I also decided to declutter this Camille Rose Black Castor Oil and Shebe Invigorating Scalp Treatment Shampoo. And I picked this up when it launched a few months ago along with the matching deep conditioner. I tried the deep conditioner, which I really enjoy how it performs in my hair. Respectfully, I just have absolutely no interest in trying this shampoo. So I'm going to go ahead and rehome this shampoo so that way someone can actually use, love, and appreciate it. Now those two shampoos I've never tried, but I'm also also decluttering some of my staples that I have mentioned and raved to you all about on this channel for quite some time. The first staple that I'm going to be decluttering is this Trelux Curl Renew and Restore Gentle Cleansing Rinse. I do believe that I have mentioned this in a previous wash day video and I'll try to link that in the cards. You all know that I have partnered on previous videos with Trelux before, but I have never been sponsored when I am mentioning this shampoo to you all. I absolutely love it. It gives a very thorough cleanse while also being extremely gentle to your strands. Also really love the loose aloe vera gel like consistency of this shampoo which helps me to finger detangle and keep my hair manageable while cleansing. This is a staple in my regimen and trust and believe I am only getting rid of this because I have too many of them. And believe it or not I am also going to be parting ways with the main choice exotic kool-aid minty guava and kiwi shampoo which I have mentioned in no less than 50 videos at this point. You all already know how I feel about this shampoo. It's so softening and moisturizing and the mint y'all know it's all about the mint for me and even looking at it now I am already contemplating taking it back and putting it back on the shelf because I love it so much but because of the reformulations and them ignoring my email I've decided to go ahead and part ways with the main choice so R.I.P. Also going to be getting rid of this Unicurl Moisturizing and Silkening Deep Conditioner. I have featured this deep conditioner on the channel and of course I'll try to find that video and link it in the cards. It has been quite some time since I've used this deep conditioner but I do really enjoy how it performed in my hair. This does claim to be moisturizing and silkening but that wasn't really my experience with it. I got more strengthening silkening but this gave my hair a nice boost of elasticity. My curls were pop pop popping. But like I said, it's been quite some time since I've used or even reached for this Unicurl deep conditioner. So I'm gonna go ahead and rehome her. Another product I'm getting rid of is this Allocate Naturals Lemongrass Leave-In Conditioner. And if you have been around for a while, you'll know that this was a staple at one point. But baby, I don't believe that there's been an official communication, but as far as I am concerned, there is just no way that this leave-in conditioner has not been reformulated. It just don't, it don't give what it was supposed to have gave no more. This used to give such great moisture and softness and luster to the hair. And this just don't do that for me or my homegirls anymore. So, sorry, she got to go. 
also going to be decluttering this main crush crisis control ayurvedic leave-in which i do believe i featured in a video a long long time ago so if i can find it i'll make sure i leave it linked in the cards this leave-in performed very well in my hair very softening moisturizing and of course because it is the main crush we know there are fantastic ayurvedic nourishing ingredients that will benefit the hair and the scalp but as you can see as much as i enjoy the performance of this leave-in conditioner in my hair i have not reached for it because it is still taped up so because i haven't reached for it i'm gonna go ahead and rehome this one as well also going to be parting ways with an extra bottle of one of my faves this is the trey lux untie the not nourishing leave-in conditioner which i have told you all about in countless videos sponsored and unsponsored at this point you all know that i love this leave-in it's moisturizing it's softening it's tangling and it smells like the holidays and it just is a great time okay i am only 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 getting rid of this because i have like four of them i don't need that many lastly for leave-ins i'm going to be getting rid of this curls blueberry bliss reparative leave-in conditioner and you all know that i just got this at the world natural hair show in a goodie bag and just based on the reviews that i have seen of this leave-in conditioner I don't know if I'm necessarily convinced that this is something that I just need. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this. And of course, if I ever really want to try it, I can go ahead and pick it up at Ulta. But for now, we're we're gonna go ahead and part ways. Also going to be getting rid of this Reflex Curl Styling Serum from Trey Lux, which I have featured in a couple of videos as well. This is a great styler, gives great definition, gives a good flexible hold. This is also a glycerin-free styler, so I absolutely love to use it during this time of year when it's warmer and more humid out because it really helps to combat frizz and maintain the style's longevity. Again, I am only getting rid of this Reflex Curl Styling Serum because I have so many bottles of these in my stash so that's just unnecessary we gonna go ahead and get rid of this one also going to be decluttering this curls protect me edge styling pomade from their hair under their collection aka the protective style collection it is no secret on this channel that i practically never slick my edges down edges and baby hair is just the magical black girl skill that i have not taken the time to hone and develop so i'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this and give this to someone who can actually use it because I ain't. Well folks, that about wraps up today's declutter video. But of course, if you are interested in these or seeing what other products that I'm going to be listing, make sure you check my Depop link down below in the description box. And of course, if you don't wanna be bothered and you wanna pick up these products yourself, I'll make sure I have links to them down below in the description box for you as well. Make sure you drop down in the comments, let me know your thoughts, and let me know what products you're gonna be decluttering from your stash and why. On your way to watching another video of mine, please make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. Thank Thank you so 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 much for watching please 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 be safe and i'll catch you in the next one